Hello world, welcome to the city of Pomelo. Pomelo means take it easy and I guess that is the perfect definition of life here in Split. My name is Ella and I am a travel blogger. Uh, and my blog uh, goes from around 70,000 to 300,000 readers per month. I uh, grew up in Zagreb, but I spent all of my summers here, around five months in a year. So Split always really reminds me of summer and sun and fun. So we are currently at the map of the city, a Roman palace built in city. It is the only emperor's palace which became a city. For those who watched Game of Thrones, this is where the Dragon Den is, which brings a lot of tourists here to this place. But it's also a basement of this city. Uh, I am unsure what happened underneath here, but I'm sure lots of fun things happened. <laughs> in the split food market. My grandmother used to live just across the street from this market. Uh, this has literally not changed uh, since I was born. It's like the last place where you can really get like proper organic food. Yes, asparagus. <laughs> around a thousand islands. So people who come to Croatia, they usually like to do a lot of island hopping. And obviously Hvar, where we are now, is one of the most popular islands to hop onto. Pardon? My blog is called I am Ella. I've been to 134 cities in the last two years. So I really like to just see how other people live and what their priorities are. On my blog, you can already find some posts I did from Split and Var. Oh, I usually wrote about like uh, 10, you know, like funny things that people say, so like uh, uh, useful phrases you can use in Dalmatian. You can, you know, order coffee by yourself and stuff like that. Making uh, wine and olive oil is very popular in Croatia. People do it as a hobby or professionally. So for those people who come to visit the islands, they can still buy originally made products directly from the people who make it. And this is for extra virgin olive oil. This is just one of the UNESCO heritage sites. We have a lot of them in Croatia. But I haven't been to this fortress before. Actually, I did not expect the view that we have right now. I wouldn't mind waking up every morning to a view like this. So for those who like to escape the crowded areas or just need some peace and quiet, you can come to the Hill of Marian, which is only five minutes away from the main promenade. Locals like to come here to swim, jog, run, walk, eat or drink, or you can just come here and enjoy the view and the weather. So this is just one of the beaches we have here in Split. We have 15 kilometers worth of beaches. People really like them, they come here to swim and sunbathe. And during the night, they bring some drinks, invite some friends, and maybe even make a barbecue. So it's dinner time in Split, and I'm taking you guys to try out the best and the most original dish in Dalmatia, and it's called pasticada. Okay, so we are currently in the kitchen. Uh, Pasticada is very unique uh, and also my favorite because it's prepared with time and love. It's beef, 
and you put it in the vinegar and you leave it for one day and then the next day the pastizada is prepared. The meal itself is very full in flavor and most of the people in Dalmatia really love it. If you don't mind me, I'm going to try a little piece. Mm. As the people from Split would say, was last. We really hope to see you soon in our beautiful Split, because a person who is tired of Split is tired of life. Good night everyone, Jivali.